And the next biography that I want to share with you is a biography of a man that I would say is to many considered to be virtually untouchable in the sense that he is a, uh, he represents goodness and kindness to so many of us. Uh, somebody that existed with n nary a scandal, if, uh, if I could say so, and, and that is uh, a rare thing. Um, the book that I'm talking to you about today is The Good Neighbor, uh, The Life and Work of Fred Rogers by Maxwell King. Now, <clears throat> if you're not familiar with Fred Rogers, then you have lived a sad existence. Fred Rogers had a TV show called Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood for quite some time on PBS. Um, and that show uh, evolved after Fred's passing into a cartoon called Daniel Tiger, uh, which I know my children really loved. Uh, the show was about being kind, being a good neighbor. It was about managing your feelings. Um, I know that there are lessons from that that have really helped my son to manage some of his emotions, which is a blessing. Um, he was someone that was a genuinely kind and caring and concerned person for other people. Uh, he was a uh, ordained minister. Uh, he was an educator for most of us. He was a, a champion of reading. Um, LeVar Burton, who did the Reading Rainbow, uh, on the back of this book says that, you know, basically we all stood on his shoulders. Um, he was someone who fought for public television and for, for what PBS could do for other people and for what Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood was doing for others. Um, it's a really powerful book and I highly recommend that you read this story about Mr. Rogers and hear how he came to be the way that he was and believe the things that he believed. Uh, one of his quotes that's really been making the rounds in the last few years is that whenever something terrible is happening, always look for the helpers. And that's something that Mr. Rogers would always say that his mother had taught him. Um, and so I thank him for being someone with positivity, kindness, and hope. And I definitely recommend that you read more about him by picking up this book.